Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to configure Ubuntu server in VirtualBox. First, let's press on new in VirtualBox, then let's name our virtual machine. Now let's choose our machine type. It's Linux, Linux Ubuntu, okay, you can select an ISO, ISO image here, but I'll skip it and add an ISO image later. Let's choose our memory and CPUs. That's about fine, and I'll change CPUs to two cores. That should be all right. Now let's choose our di disk size. Next, finish. Okay, and now let's append our ISO by pressing on settings, then storage. Now press on empty DVD let's press on this DVD picture and now choose a disk file and I have my ISO downloaded from official Ubuntu server site okay open then press on OK now you can start your virtual machine okay let's enter try or install Ubuntu server also I'll maybe scale the window a bit okay After that, you can choose your language. I'll choose English. To navigate through the system, use arrows. I'll choose English and press enter. And then keyboard layout. You can choose it by pressing on enter and, and then selecting from the list. I will set it to English United States. Okay, enter to go further then I'll go I'll press on done but you can also change the settings now let's configure our network interface I'll press on done because it's automatically configured you can enter your proxy address I'll press on done to skip it Then you can wait for the mirror location to be tested. It passed the test, so let's press on done. Now you can either choose use an entire disk or custom storage layout. I'll choose use an entire disk and press and go down to done press on enter now you can see your file system summary you can change some settings but I'll do the default thing so press and done then go down and press on enter to continue now create your user account your server's name let's name it hard reset server pick a username and choose your password ok 
okay and then go down to dom press on enter now uh, go to continue you can also enable ubuntu pro but i'll skip it you can check install open ssh server i'll check it to install it while installing ubuntu server now you can check another uh, services to install in server i'll skip it and just go to dom enter and now it's installing after the installation is complete you can go down to reboot now press on enter wait for the virtual machine to reboot okay let's remove the installation medium storage oh okay it's empty so there's no problem about that let's press enter okay and now it's rebooting i'll we scale the window a little bit more and now the ubuntu server has been installed you can log in by pressing enter and then enter your login and password enter you've been logged in and that's all for today, don't forget to like and subscribe, see you next time.